found this old book that tells about vampires. And guess what? Come on, I already know the facts of vampire life. It says that you can turn into a bat. Hey, I've never seen you do that. Well, I, uh... It says that you'll be able to change when you're old enough. Oh, I'm old enough. Shh. I do it all the time. Show us! What? Now? Uh, okay, but, um... I, I need some privacy. I'll be up in the belfry. You know, where the bats are. <gasps> Smooches, I've never transformed in my life. Think like a bat. Think like a bat. I'm a bat. Now! No use. I'll never change. <gasps> Draculaura? She did it! Bat. Bat. <laughs> Today was so much fun. <gasps> you changed back! You were amazing! Whole class! And you got the only A. You totally rocked it. <laughs> no idea what's going on. Well, I wasn't sure I could make the track meet because my little brother bit my leg, but that's not gonna stop me. I'm totally running, and I'm gonna win. She will not win. I was running unopposed in the Scream Queen election. I think a little campaign gossip will ensure that I get all the votes. Claudine, outstanding in a field, got a major case of carnivorous fleas and is out of the running. Save your vote. And so no one knows I started it. Ah, ha! Don't tell anyone. I know just the gossip ghoul to deliver the message. Send! Oh, my! This is huge! I gotta tell everyone! Wait, I can't. I shouldn't. I want to, but I can't! Maybe just Frankie. She's not just anyone. So cute! Send. It doesn't make much sense. Send to anyone. Well, okay. Voltage! My bad. Texting and walking. <laughs> Send to all. Thanks to the best viral text campaign in Monster High history, the winner of Scream Queen is <laughs> Claudine Wolf. What? How could this happen? Everybody voted for her. How to choose? Claudine. Outstanding in her field. We'll have a school carnival free if you vote. Wow! Can you believe it, Cleo? I wasn't even running! Jaundice Brothers, so two centuries ago. Justin Fighter, delicious. He burns. Ignore. Hey, ladies, check me. I'm on fire today. Conceited Mac. Get over yourself, Heath. You're not that fast, Heath. I got more hustle in one claw than you got in your whole body. Whoa, my ears are burning. Don't you know girls are too delicate for track? No competition. You did not just say that to me today. I could totally burn past you on the track. Bring it, Sparky. First one around the track twice wins. Loser cleans the pit of horror. It's on. Here, hold my purse and my books, my earrings, laptop, phone, makeup bag, all my bracelets. Hey, Claude, aren't you gonna stay and see me flame past your little sister? Oh, bro, I can't watch this. You had to choose today. How come I every afternoon to laugh at you? Hit it, ghouls. Bet you didn't realize it was a full moon tonight. Oh! <laughs> Me and my ghouls will come and visit you every afternoon <laughs> to laugh at you. Ah, oh, blame retardants. <laughs> <laughs> According to my horoscope, I'm going to meet the perfect guy today. Handsome, chiseled, solid, and dependable. Ooh, it says he'll be the first monster that you gaze when your eyes leave this page. <laughs> That's the guy. How do I look? Amazing. Gorgeous. You always do. I know, right? <laughs> it's a curse. Where'd he go? Bat. It says if I don't meet him before the end of school, it won't come true. Two minutes until the final bell. Ghouls, stop him. All over it. He went this way. <laughs> Sphinx, heading for the boy's locker. We'll lose him. Frankie, redirect. I'm going to work on plan B. I'm on it. 
Okay, I'm coming. If he steps outside the school, then we're too late. What's plan B? You are. Yeah, and then I said, come on, not even ghosts wear white after Slaver Day. <laughs> As if. But the lady said they only have it in white. Oh, my horoscope was totally right. You are the perfect guy. Such a good listener. Ooh, be positive. Awesome. Not. I deserve better. I studied all night. Mr. Rudder never gives A's. There's nothing you can do. Wrong. It belonged to Pharaoh. Not a lot in common. It gives me the power of persuasion. Should you be messing around with that, Cleo? Didn't your dad say that all those ancient idols are cursed? I've got this. Mr. Rudder, I totally did the work to perfection. Why didn't I get an A? I don't give A's. But I deserve an A+. Plus. You deserve an A+. Plus. Gotta be a downside. Seems fishy. Might come back to bite you. Oh, please. I got this. Oh, no, way too crowded. Oh, we'll be late for class. Wanna bet? <laughs> I could learn to love this power. Tonight's homework? <laughs> Have fun. Cleo's been working that idol like a credit card with no limit. Yeah, but what happens when the bill comes? A flawless day. You ghouls fussed about nothing. There is no curse of the idol. I told you I got it. What? What's wrong? You don't got it. <laughs> to survive this test, you have to keep your egg babies from breaking for one week. Any cracks, you fail. <laughs> Oh, I love eggs. Give it, Flame Boy. First, I'm going to revamp you total makeover. Easiest assignment ever. Deuce, do your thing. Excellent. That'll wear off in a week, right? Yep. Maybe you should switch partners. Why would you say that? Everyone knows sea monsters are bad parents. Not true. That's an old fisherman's tale. Seven days, no cracks, or you fail. He's just been anti-phibian. Well, we'll show him. We'll be the most fantastic parents ever. <laughs> Crack! You fail! Crikey! I don't understand. We did everything right. Where did you get these? Gargoyle nest, top of the library. <laughs> hey, ours is the only one that hatched. I knew we'd make great parents. invited you to eat lunch with him and his bloodies. Mm. Don't be shy. I know that you and Slow-Mo will have plenty to moan about. Okay? Mm. Then we'll go together. If you're not the only girl, you won't be as nervous. Frankie's got your back. Come on. Zombies. <laughs> they just need something to break the ice. I don't know about breaking ice. I know you melt a few hearts. <laughs> I don't feel the heat. Uh, could you aim that elsewhere? You and I could make a good match. <sighs> Coolia, I have to go check my face. I know I'm supposed to be there for you. Sometimes Heath is just a little charring for me. Uh -huh. You think that'll work? Thanks for switching seats, Heat. The light over there really brings out the red in your eyes. <laughs> hey, not cool! <laughs> <laughs> hey, check it out. I'm gonna get some villagers. Whoa! You're funny. I don't like <gasps> Cool, cool, cool. <laughs> See you at my house at eight. Your first slumber party. You must be freaking out. All just harmless fun. 
Until we play truth or scare. Then we find out what kind of monster you really are. <laughs> mm, slumber party, slumber party. I know there's... Aha! Truth or scare. Learn your friend's deepest secrets. <gasps> no, Cleo's been dying to find out which boy I'm crushing on. What am I gonna do? What do we do first? We could... Truth or scare? Yeah. I'm in. Unless you don't want me to find out. Oh, hey, I know. Time for makeovers. It's time for... No fight! Enough stalling. Time for truth or scare. Frankie's first. What'll it be? Truth or scare? Uh, um... Scare? I scare you to send a text message to the boys. Party at my house? Spread the word. No. <laughs> uh, I don't think that's such a good idea. Fine. Truth. Who do you have a crush on? I'll do it. Now. You sure? Okay. Send. No way. I can't believe you really did it. Oh, your parents will freak when all those boys show up at your house. My house? But Cleo, it was your phone. Oh, that's the truth. Oh, no. Well, what'd you get on your essay? The teacher said he needed to see my parents to talk about it. What? No. A parent-creature conference? It'll take the mages to swim here. You do not call a parent-creature conference with good news. Really? You must have totally failed. You might have to repeat the class. Crikey, this is terrible. I'm in no hope. Uh. Poor thing. I know. What can we do? Oh, hey, I got an idea. All he really needs to see is a family member, right? So, let's give him one. Not me. We're all in that class. He'll recognize us. So, who? Okay, Slomo, remember, you're Laguna's great aunt Lantic. Yeah, and you have two seahorses named Roger and Blinky, and you live down under. Under. You're Australian, so moan with an accent. Ready? <laughs> Why is slow mo dressed like a sand groper? Parent creature conference? Ah? Uh, uh. Well, now you don't have to wait to find out how bad it is. What? I know you were trying to help, but if I was failing before, then I'm sure gonna get expelled now. You must be so proud of Laguna. She's my best student. Best essay ever. Didn't see that coming. <sighs> you see? Told you it was good news. I am missing cheerleading practice because your arm flailage broke a statue. Excuse me? As I recall, this was not my fault. Uh, hey! Uh, get away from me! I'm caught! My office, now. A 2,000-year-old statue was smashed. What happened? It was an a- Here's the honest to Ra's truth. I command you to stop. There is no telling what precious school property you might destroy. Ah! Oh, no! And that is how Frankie, alone, smashed the that statue. That is such... I mean... The facts of that story are in such disarray, headmistress. For 2,000 years, that statue has imprisoned one of Monster High's first instructors. Smashing the statue freed her. <laughs> Professor Irene Maiden has been freed. Frankie, on behalf of the entire student body, thank you. Wait, I helped. Oh, no. Oh, my back! What? Why? How? A confluence that only happens every thousand years. It's both Friday the 13th and also the 31st of October. That's not possible. Weird, huh? Today is the worst bad luck day ever. Yeah. yeah. <gasps> Jinx! <gasps> A perfect storm of bad luck. At least until 3 o'clock. When the bell rings, it's over. Six more hours. No worries, ghoul friends. I possess the amulet of Nuck and Nutton that will protect the wearer, me, and anyone who is with me. Bad luck and all. Well, if you're wearing it, where is it? It doesn't go with my outfit, so Gouya here is carrying it for me. Oh, no! There she is! Refreshing. I don't think I can survive till three. Come on. To the left. No, no, not that left. 
is she doing good? Oh, oh she is good. <sighs> You're right, Gulia. It kind of does go with her outfit. <laughs> Trash into clean green fuel. Wow! It must be Gulia's. Wrong. Mine. This, uh, whatever, Mahiki, will make me the queen of the mad science fair. The throne will be mine. Um, Cleo, that's not a throne. Cha! I think I know what a throne looks like. The effects of water on toilet paper. Oh, Gulia, how can you let Cleo rip you off? Mm. You gotta stand up for yourself. Yeah, you're not Cleo's servant, right? It's an injustice. You gotta take action. Mm. Cleo is heading for a fall. Thank you. Yes, my project is superior. The throne is mine! Um, Cleo, that's not a throne. It's me science project. A rehydration chamber. Say goodbye to dry skin. <laughs> Not funny. I hope she's wearing her freaky and fabulous all-day waterproof <gasps> mascara. Because this could go on all day. Werewolf or vampire? Hmm. Why not choose both? We are both totally well. You know, talking about boys? Not this time. The new movie is coming out. <laughs> Twy Hard? Actually, Twy Hard 3, Twy Hotter, The Final Sparkle. I've seen the first two like a thousand times each. How many times have you seen it? Oh, I've never seen a movie. Oh, yeah, come on. Come on. What's the malfunction? 16 days old, never had an opportunity. Ghouls, we have a mission. To the auditorium. Hey, out of the way, a situation coming through. Here's the first movie, making up. The second movie, the keychain. It is critical that Frankie's first movie experience be perfect. Draculaura, you plug in the projector. Laguna, turn up the sound. I'll handle the woofers. Don't forget the popcorn. Oh, the tissues. Uh, can I help? No, no, don't lift a finger. Just enjoy the movie. Uh, hey, guys. Um, I do know a little about electricity, and, um, that looks like you're about to overload the... Ah! How are we going to watch the movie? Yeah, I was totally sparking at the bolts to see it. What? Contact! Uh, how's the movie? Mm, awesome! You are gonna love it! Yes, mix 1001. 